Hey guys, uh, so today I'm going to go ahead and do a review of the Fountain Blue Hotel here in uh, South Beach, Miami. And uh, pretty much I'm just going to take you through the entire uh, property. Uh, it is located on 44th and Collins. Uh, I would say it, so the, the, the way South Beach is set up, the main action on Ocean Drive is from like 8 to like, I would say 22. Uh, in my opinion, Fountain Blue is on 44th and Collins, uh, which is probably about a five minute Uber ride to the main strip. Um, it's located secluded and is on purpose. Uh, literally, the hotel is like the its own community. It has its own private beach, uh, has about seven pools, tons of cabanas, um, about 11 restaurants. La Cote is my favorite restaurant here. Um, it's uh, got a great bar, great rooftop, good food as well, good drinks. Um, on Saturdays, they have a pool party um, down by the DJ booth. Um, it's really, really good pool party. Your favorite celebrity probably walking through the lobby. Um, I feel like, you know, it's a great place just for everybody. Um, and it's definitely a luxurious hotel, um, you know, filled with great scenery and everything. So I'm going to show you the room. I'm on the, uh, the hotel side. There's a condo in the hotel side and they're both available, um, you know, to stay. Um, at night, the, the condo side has more of the suites as well as the hotel side as well. Um, I would say the hotel side is a little bit more modern. Uh, this is, uh, you know, Miami Art Deco style hotel, but it's definitely upgraded. One of the best hotels um, in Miami. And uh, so I'm going to take you through there and uh, pretty much go from there. All right, so I'm going to pretty much uh, do a video of the entire hotel. Uh, this is the Fountain Blue Miami Beach. It's quarantine, uh, well not quarantine, but COVID-19, so I gotta wear a mask. So I'll try to be on purpose about, you know, hearing me when I'm uh, recording.
So this is the view on the ninth floor, right? When you get off the elevator. So now I'm gonna take you to the room uh, and then uh, pretty much gonna go from there. This is the hallway. I am in the Chateau side of the building. We got some uh, people in here cleaning. What's going on? Huh? So we are going to 944 is the room. Uh, so they're pretty much all in order, like every hotel. <laughs> all right, scan in here, put the key. The white stuff I'm wearing, they check your temperature because of COVID when you come into the hotel. Uh, so the first thing you enter when you see in the room, uh, we got the mini bar, it's fully stocked. I'll go ahead and open it here so you can see I uh, got your regular stuff that you would have in the mini bar. I uh, took the Gatorade. It's a little pricey, about $6, $12 for water, um, things like that. Uh, but it's a mini bar, so sometimes you have to expect that. But there's stores around the hotel as well, so you can get drinks. Um, this is the bathroom. Uh, pretty simple. Uh, got a uh, small TV here. Uh, I want to see the slides. Ooh, twist turns, uh, got the handle, regular uh, toilet seat here. Uh, then we have the uh, standing shower. Everything, blow dryer, uh, you know, everything that comes with a regular hotel. Uh, then we got a mirror in here. Closet. 
Got two robes in the closet, ironing board. Uh, I got a safe in case you leave your stuff or you need protection for your stuff. Uh, definitely like this art painting. It says, I would not make any more boring art over and over. So I think that's pretty cool. Um, the bed is not made up, but here is the bed. Uh, just woke up. It's about nine o'clock in Miami, which is way too early to be up in Miami. Uh, TV. These are my personal items. My laptop. I uh, got my gimbal, uh, my drone right here. Um, but yeah, nice, comfortable bed. I uh, got a little desk. I'm assuming that phone doesn't work. Uh, so they they actually have a another phone. I literally discovered that this morning. Uh, and then one thing I like about the view uh, is an ocean view. See the pool. Uh, view of the hotel is pretty good. And uh, all in all, great place to stay when you come to Miami. Uh, Fountain Blue Hotel. All right, so all in all, great stay at the Fountain Blue. Uh, got this little race band. Like I said, they check your temperature uh, when you walk in. Uh, one thing I realized uh, yesterday, the beach and the pools at the Fountain Blue, they never close. We were on the beach till about 3 a.m. yesterday in the morning. Uh, and it's private. It's a private beach, so which is great. And it's on South Beach. Feels like you're, you know, in a different country because the beach is open. The beach in Miami Beach closes at like 8 o'clock. So imagine being on the beach 3 a.m. in the morning. Uh, the cabanas at night, nobody's there. So pretty much it's uh, free for all. You can just chill on the cabanas. Um, I believe nine o'clock, you know, it was really quiet at the pool. Super chill. Enjoy my time over here. Uh, it's a five star hotel, so they definitely have great service. Um, and um, all in all, great trip. And uh, one of my favorite places to stay when I get to Miami. Uh, so make sure, subscribe, uh, comment, let me know what you think about the video, and uh, pretty much go from there.